Hi, I'm Melissa DuPont with Water Street News. This is Wednesday, January 31, 2023. Let's go straight down to Jose Fernandez who is on Rabin Court. Jose, how is the foot traffic where you are? Thank you, Melissa. It's been a busy day here in this part of the city. We've seen a lot of people walking, likely due to the new French restaurant opening next door. We have noticed more activity with outdoor furniture being unloaded and construction activity in the retail locations. Now let's turn it over to Alfred Wainwright for more on Boulogne Brasserie. I am standing directly in front of Boulogne Brasserie, and I must say I was pleasantly surprised. Next Level Brands has done a stupendous job in creating a restaurant that is sure to please. As a Brit, I'm always looking for a restaurant that can provide a taste of home, and Boulogne Brasserie certainly delivered. The Boule Bays was a particular highlight. The combination of seafood, vegetables and herbs was cooked to perfection, and the flavours were simply divine. The duck confit was also a winner. The duck was both shredded and on the leg, and the accompanying sauce was a perfect accompaniment. The service was a five-star dining experience. The staff were friendly and attentive, and the atmosphere was electric with music that sounded like my favourite disco. Overall, I would highly recommend Boulogne Brasserie to anyone looking for a taste of France in Tampa. I may stroll right back inside for a bijou and blue crab beignets. The food was delicious and the service was top-notch. Alfred Wainwright signing off for Water Street News in Tampa, Florida.